Hey you guys, so um, I had a request to make a video on how to do the daisy design because we did it um, a little before spring break and some of you might have forgot and some of you might not have been there that day. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to get your compass and you're going to set your radius. Okay, and you don't want to make it really small. Like you probably want to try to make it as big as, as you can with this page. So hopefully you guys were here when I gave you like the clean sheet of paper to use. Um, so you don't want to use a piece of binder paper. So if you don't have that paper, um, see if you can find a blank piece of paper. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to make, oops, that's not going to work. Hold on. Add. That one was really loose. Okay, so you're going to make a circle on your paper. Okay, and remember you put all of the weight on that tip right there. Okay, so I'm going to try to make a circle. There we go. Okay, now I want to be really careful that I don't squeeze this, okay? You don't want to squeeze this and make sure when you're holding this, either you hold it completely by the top or if you really want to hold it on the side, that you hold it just on this side. Don't put your hands on both. Okay, so without changing this radius, you pick any point on the circle that you want, and you're going to make an arc. Okay, and then what you do is where that arc intercepted the circle, you're going to pick this up again. You're not going to squeeze it. You're going to put your point there, and you're going to make another arc. Okay, then put your point there. And another arc. Okay, so you're just going to keep going around making arcs. And what ends up happening, let's see, is that you end up making a little daisy. And sometimes these can be hard at first um, until you get a good feel for the compass. So you might want to make sure that you're practicing a couple of times um, before you go to make your final one. Okay, so your, your um, picture has to have a daisy in it, and then you can add whatever you want, okay? So, you know, at this point, I can, you know, whatever you feel like adding. Maybe I want to add a circle here. Um, oops, that one went a little too far. Okay, so maybe I want to do something like that, and then maybe... I don't know, I want to circle out here that goes in between all these. So you're going to use your wonderfully creative brain to come up with something really cool looking. Okay? And add a bunch of stuff. Let me see if I have the folder that has some examples in it. Um, because then you're going to color it in after you're done. Okay? So... Here are some examples of ones that people just left behind. Okay, so this person did some interesting designs. Um, so this person really did some interesting stuff, but they kind of have a little daisy in there. Um, there's a little interesting one. Okay, so this, um, you'll see if you play around with it, if you just kept on going, it would just make these circles on the outside. Um, Okay, so you're just trying to come up with something that you think is kind of cool. Okay. Um, very interesting on that one. Um, this one I thought was really interesting, just the way that they decided to color it in. But they've got their daisy in there. Okay. So just different ideas on how, you know, you could... Put that together and color it. Okay. Another one there. Okay, so you're going to bring that to school with you, um, and it is going to be worth a grade. Okay, so make sure on Thursday that you bring that in. All right, hope that helps. Whoops. Bye bye. Maybe goodbye.